Yeah, this is one of the most exciting pieces in the sale. This is Shoeless Joe Jackson's bat. It's one of only two known uh, professional model bats. It's the only one known with his signature burned into the uh, barrel here. And this is from about 1917 to 1920, so during the kind of Black Sox years, uh, heading into 1919 World Series. And it's the highest estimated piece in the sale. It's estimated at five hundred to seven hundred thousand dollars. Well, I think you know some of the photography is uh, very unique, Babe Ruth wise. We have one of an early photo, a 1914 Providence Grays. And uh, what's great about this photo is the minor leagues, and you know there he is right in the middle. You know the biggest guy standing there right in the middle. Looks like he owns the place. You know, and, and you know and that was that was him. I think one of the most interesting aspects of this collection is the Negro League memorabilia that's offered here. Uh, incredible stuff from obviously from photography to bats, but also documents and letters and, and these things are just incredibly rare. There's a book, uh, The History of Colored Baseball, uh, which was published in 1907, which documents the history from the 1880s to 1907 and it's basically the only document we have of Negro League history from that time period. There's maybe five known copies of this book. So we have one of those. I think that's one of the more interesting segments of the collection.